hello viewer welcome to artistry so today we have a project at hand and we'd like to interpret this uh, project we see the various steps of making it how we start how we progress and what is the ending of it so behind me here is a chalkboard that i'll use to uh, illustrate some of the calculations that we do so that we can be able to constructively come up with the project as well as have a have a, a scale on which we are going to rate it as pertains to the market rate and so on and so on so the first thing that we will we'll be doing is to is to to prepare a cutting list the cutting list is a uh, kind of a, a document that we shall use or some calculations that we can use to determine the materials that are needed and hence the cost of the project so before me is a, is a stool or right behind uh, next to me it's a stool a simple stool that has been shaped and made so that it can be used uh, in the domestic setup could be used in the house or outside the house or just anywhere around the kitchen or anywhere else where you need to to sit as you wait for something or as you entertain your visit as well so the the stool construction is our uh, it's our project at hand and uh, to start with we will start with the uh, the materials so on materials Uh, we we'll consider the, the the wood we have we have we have the timber that has been used we have some screws that we have used to join so we can list them down here so we have timber we have uh, glue we have screws we have sandpaper Uh, then we have varnish we have varnish then we have the hand tools that we are going to use we're going to use hand tools we're going to use varnish uh, for our project so i think these are the major inputs that we need before even we start the pro the, the construction of the stool so uh, on timber is when where we shall uh, spend our good time there so that we can see uh, or quantify this project and see how much is it going to take worth of timber and to determine the timber that we need we we'll prepare a cutting list So the cutting list will help us uh, to, to, to determine the timber that we need. And then from there, we can now move to the others. Now, on the cutting list, we need timber, of course. Uh, we have the item, uh, description, number, and then we have the length, width, and the thickness. So we will have the various items here, and then we shall determine them one by one. So I'll keep measuring and referring to my, uh, to my project right here, because we want to duplicate this and get another one exactly like this. So to start with, I'll start with the widest part here, that is the top. But the top again we said we laminate the pieces so i'll quantify it here first and say the top we said we, me we measure in millimeters is 300 millimeters so that is equivalent to one foot so item number one is the top uh, number it is only one so the length is 300 and then it is square 300 by 300 and then thickness uh, thickness is 20 20 millimeters 
Remember, everything we shall be doing, we shall be using the millimeters for our measurement. So the top we are through with it. Now we move to the stands. Uh, the stands, they are 35 by 35 millimeters. So we, we say there are four. There are four stands, uh, which are, oh, sorry, item number two. Uh, number there are four there are four and then we have 35 by 35 and then the length the length I use the edge here to measure the length this is 375 uh, the length is 375 by 35 by 35 so that is how we fill in the, the cutting list. Now we have the top, we have the, the stands, then we have the rails. The rails, the visible part here is 205, but we have a joint that is going to get inside here up to maximum of two thirds. So if I give it about 20 inside here and 20 here, uh, 40 I add to 205. So that makes it 245. So that is the, the length, 245. And then this is item number three. These are the rails, bottom rails. Bottom rail. And then there are four pieces, 245 by the width is 30 and the thickness is 20. We are still moving on. Now we are at the top rail. The top rail is a bit wider than the bottom rail. So we determine the length inside to inside here. We have 275. We add uh, 2020, 20, 275 plus 20 plus 20. That is plus 40. 275 these are this is number four top rail uh, there are four pieces uh, 275 sorry one 175 175 plus 40 that makes it 215 215 by by 40 by let me put it well so that I can be able to measure it by 20 so <clears throat> the first step is to prepare the cutting list the cutting list the, uh, this section is for finished sizes so uh, for for the cutting sizes we have allowances that we use so cutting uh, cutting list allowances that means uh, when i'm when i'm going to cut my raw piece i'm not going to cut it at 300 by 300 because it will, it will be subject to trimming and sanding and finishing so on the length on the length I will add 12 millimeters on the width I will add 6 millimeters on the thickness I will add 3 millimeters so that means for the length 300 here I will cut the, 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 the row length as 3 12 for 375 I will add 12 and I will get uh, 387 387 and so on and so on on the on the width i'll add 300 uh, 6 to 300 then i'll cut the width at 306 then it will be subjected to planing cutting trimming and everything else so the final size uh, is what we have here on the chalkboard so that is a simple step of preparation of the cutting list it is the first step that we do when we are uh, we are we are we are preparing uh, the construction of a project. So our tool, the, 
the project of the day, uh, we'll have this as our first uh, step, the cutting list preparation. Now we know that when we have a top, one piece, 300 by 300, 20 uh, millimeters thickness, we have one piece, four pieces of stands, uh, four pieces of rails, and four pieces of top rails, uh, and some other pieces that I have just uh, I had forgotten for holding the top to the to the to the rail. Uh, we have those pieces which are which are 170 by 20 by 30. So those ones I'm going to call them the inner rails uh, 170 by 40 by 20 so those are only two so with this now i am sure i can come up with this project this tool so for now uh that that is the step steps of preparing the cutting list of this tool so we are going to take a short break and then we'll be back to see what next so stay tuned <laughs> 